everyone, Mike is here and today I'm gonna raise another uh, concern. If you own the Wolf Pop or I think there is a couple other models, so they most likely you will see that when you fill up your fresh water tank, you can see the water dripping from somewhere here instead of this little screen hole here. And that's a problem. That's just because they do not put and they like rarely put this the water hose uh, in there. I will show you in the details how to easily fix it in 10 minutes. So basically I just drove by the Home Depot and bought uh, this hose. I know it's not the, the water, uh, the fresh water hose, drinkable water hose, but that's the only option I have. And uh, it's, uh, please find uh, half inch inner diameter and five eighths in the outer diameter as well of, as well as those things here and you you would need two of those and about four six feet of those so this come in the bulk of like for five dollars or so and that's the only thing we need let me show you how to attach it all right as you can see here's a little uh pipe that's sticking out so that's where your water is leaking out from and that's if it's not done in the right way you're like losing what's what's bothering me that you're losing about a uh, quarter of your fresh water while you're driving from one spot to another so what we're gonna be doing is we take this hose we will fit it through next to the other pipes is go ahead coming around and we'll bring it out here and connect it here once you connect it here you tighten it up and I think you're good from one side and after that you need to feed the other end of the pipe uh, under your queen bed and connect to the screen at hall where the it's supposed to go so that's a section under your queen bed here that's where your water um, water heater is and the water pump so and I once I get an access in here, I realize they put a, even the silicon here. I don't know for like I don't know some bugs not coming through or whatever the reason they was in uh, in their mind. But we'll fix now. The problem is to fix because uh, to clean this one out here of silicon. Huh, that's given me another uh, problems. I also gotta clean this one out to find out the way I can pull my pipe through. So, and it looks like it's sideways, surprisingly. It's going this way here, so that probably make it a little more difficult, but we'll get it, we'll see from down there. Alright, once I fit it through, I uh, cut it just right enough and leave a, like a little slug just in case. So, and I will stick this hose on that end and we'll finish it up. So, I have no more problems with, uh, with the leaking water and losing the good quarter of the water while driving to the campsite. That was a problem because we like, uh, we do a lot of dry camping 
with two kids and when you come to the campsite and realize you have less much less water than you left with in uh, somewhere in the middle of nowhere with no source of water that's that's not good not good I am glad I had another trailer where I seen how it's done and when it was a problem with this one I kind of look around and quickly realize what's going on here all right it looks like it's done deal I will close everything up and and call it a day all right bye bye guys if you like it if you found it helpful give me a like and see you on the next videos bye bye